Now it's just like a deadlift. Lift it up and then press it right to the chest, okay? One, two, three. Alright, so my plates are gonna catch on the door frame here, so right in this wall be a little bit tricky. That maxed me out. Oh. Can you hold this for a sec, honey? We're back. Yesterday was a crap day full of rain and all sorts of sorrow. Mostly just rain. So I just farted around in the shop and I'm working on getting my compressed air set up. 
installed, which will be awesome, but the sun is back out and I gotta get this roof on. So we're building trusses today. I've never really, I've never built a truss before. So I've seen a lot of trusses. I've installed a lot of trusses, but I've never actually built one. So I got a big box of, where did I put that box? Oh yeah, I got a box of Simpson strong tie, uh, mending plates, the gang nails or whatever you call them. I'm not much of a math guy, as you know, cause I didn't pay attention in school, but what I can do is draw a straight line. So I'm going to snap lines using my, my ink -a -dink -a line here. That's not the technical term, that's just what I call it. So my ink line, it's like a chalk line, but it uses ink and a really fine thread. So it leaves a, like a ballpoint pen accurate line and it doesn't wash off like chalk does. Once the ink dries, it'll be there forever. So I'm gonna snap a straight line, which is gonna be obviously my collar tie. I'm gonna just measure out my roof angles and do a little rise and a little bit of run and a little bit of geometry trigonometry. And I'm gonna actually draw each two by four where it goes and all the angles so that I have an actual full size schematic of my truss. And then all I gotta do is lay out my wood where it goes, draw the line, cut it, and then I'll just tack screw everything into the floor tight the way it is, right? And then I'll throw my gang nails on there, hammer them on, got a truss. Flip it over, gang nail the other side, boom, you got a truss. together my first trust and I really understand why people order these from trust factories because nailing in these little mending plates oh, oh, oh. forearms are just rock hard right now oh, I feel that tomorrow hey and I only gotta do like eight more but it's kind of cool I made my own trust never done that before it's all about firsts here at Samurai now let's see if I made the trust the right size Typically I wouldn't do such a low pitch roof, but that's just what the existing roof on the house is. So I kind of wanted to match that so that my eave angles and stuff, I'll just go with what you got. So I think it's still gonna look cool, but typically I would never do a roof lower than a 412 pitch. This is like a two, two and a half 12 pitch. It's not even a 312. 70s, once again. <laughs> cool thing about drawing your template on the, on the ground is that you can also straighten out all your two by because a lot of them are crooked, especially ones that have been baking in the sun here. And so I just screw it down and straighten it out as I go. And then by the time I've nailed it all together, it ain't gonna go crooked again. Just eyeball the, the lines on the ground here with the square. Got your saw set to the set depth.
voila. So I'll just leave that piece there, lay the next one over top. Pretty simple work, man. A child can do it. If their arms weren't so short. Oh, this is the part that sucks. Hammering these on by hand. any better than the frame hammer. All right, well, that's all I got done this week. It's pretty awesome to see this place taking shape and the roof is going to be up next week. Next week's just gonna be an epic week. Got all the windows sitting down there. The doors are hopefully coming next week. Gosh, should have been here today or last Friday actually. But whatever, I'm gonna have that in. I'm gonna have this roof on, torched in, have this watertight. And from there, I'm gonna reframe these existing exterior wall windows, put in bigger windows there as well. So it's gonna be an awesome week. And I just wanted to let you know, I really appreciate you guys tuning in. Hope you have an awesome weekend. And if you're not, you know, hip to the scene and all the cool, current, trendy stuff that's going on, well, I'm on Instagram now, so if you want to follow a little closer and, and have pictures and stuff from me on Instagram, you can follow me there, Samurai Carpenter. That's pretty much it. I'm gonna enjoy this weekend and what's left of this sunny day because it's supposed to start raining tomorrow. Yay! Till next time, guys, Samurai out.